Hello, this is Ed Rigsby here with another cigar review. Today I'm reviewing a Hoyo de Monterey Dark Sumatra. If you were to buy it in the store, whoops, I lost this puppy. If you were to buy it in the store, here's how it comes nicely wrapped. You've got a cedar wrapping around it. I picked these up today at Total Wine and More. Why I picked some up is because um, it's one of my favorite cigars and Total Wine and More, at least the Total Wine and More in Thousand Oaks, was selling them out at a ridiculously low price of $3.99 a stick. They're usually six, seven, eight dollars um, This one, as I lit it, the first half inch was just a little raspy. I, the stick needs, uh, needs to go in the humidor for just a smidge. So if you go pick some of these up for yourself, you might want to put them in your humidor for um, a week or two because that first um, little taste, it's, it's a little bit of a taste of straw. Now that I've got it down about an inch, I've got some really nice white ash, and it's got now, now the taste is really good. I've got a little bit of a leathery taste with, with spice. It's, um, it's not too overpowering for a, uh, a dark Sumatra, which a lot of people are a little bit afraid of. Um, I gotta say, now, if you notice, I uh, just put a small punch hole in the back and uh, didn't want to have too much smoke coming through at a time. But it's got a very nice draw. Construction is great, even though this particular stick is just a teeny bit dry. Um, great construction. I think it's a cigar that you're going to really enjoy. Now, um, to go with this, when I was at the Total Wine and More today, um, they talked me into buying something I've never seen before, two stars handcrafted Kentucky straight bourbon. Doesn't say how old it is. It could have been vintage Monday. Who knows? It's uh, from Jefferson County. It's from uh, Louisville, Kentucky. Now, I've been waiting to try it. It's been sitting in the glass here for, um, oh, about a minute or two. And as I roll it around, so you're going to get my, uh, my honest first reaction from this new bourbon. Son of a gun. They were right. It's pretty good. I'm, I'm pretty impressed. It, um, well, it's not a really powerful bourbon. Let me get one more taste here. But um, it's pretty good. There's no bite. There was, wow, there's no bite at the beginning, no bite at the end. Is this low? No, it's 43% alcohol, 86 proof. Well, anyway, this is a go get. If you um, are anywhere near a uh, Total Wine and More, check out their two stars. Handcrafted bourbon. Hey, I'm pretty impressed. It's pretty darn good. One more puff here. And I got to tell you, if you go pick up some of these Hoyo de Monterey Dark Sumatras, if you don't like it, send me an email. I mean, these, these really are pretty nice cigars. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hope to see you next time.